Hey everybody, this is Matt, we're at Texas Toast Guitars. Thank you for watching the final installment of What Would Mike Learn Do? And this is what Mike Learn did. In the coming video, we are going to show you um, the uh, final culmination of Mike's vision, the Spaz Master. Should, can we show the back so we can get the Spaz in there? Um, uh, if you haven't watched the other videos, there's one video that we did where Mike came over to the shop and did all the woodwork, and then Mike did a video at his shop where he did all the paintwork. It's awesome. If you haven't watched it, links in the description below. Go watch it now. We'll wait. Okay, you should be back by now, and you should be chomping at the bit, ready to see this guitar in action. Um, in, the, in the next few minutes, we're going to show you what we did. We're going to show you how we did it. It's going to be fast, and there's going to be music. So enough of the bullshit talk, let's get down to business. Mike, so uh, the guitar is all put together, and does it meet your criteria for the vision that you had in mind? It is so far beyond my criteria uh, and, really and cool. expectations. I mean, really, I'm almost jealous I didn't work out some sort of barter deal with you uh, before we sold it. But um, Everybody watching this, including you, should be jealous of Doug Santianello, who bought this guitar. Doug, I don't know if I butchered your name again, but Doug bought this guitar, and Everybody should be jealous of Doug. This this turned out really great. What was the what was the concept here? Um, you know, I always wanted to uh, do something more cool to the, my dad's jazz master that I got, nineteen sixty three. But who wants to chop it up? So I wanted. No, to, yeah, yeah. I wanted to turn that jazz master into an eighties metal rocker. Because you and I are over fifty. <laughs> we were around in the eighties. We, we, yeah, this is the kind of stuff that we, we dug when we were watching MTV and, you know, yeah. And, yeah. 
th this is it's got it's got everything cool. I, I for, you know what I forgot. I, I look at this and I see little bitty things that I forgot that we did because it's been it's been a month or so. Mm -hmm. And yeah, everything about it is just so cool. Um, so if you are jealous of Doug who bought this guitar, it's not too late. You can sign up for our Build a Guitar with Mike Learn class, and we are going to start with this basic shape, and when you show up on day one, you're going to start airbrushing. Right. First thing out of the gate, right? Right, right there. So yeah. the guitar will be, um, it'll be rough cut out and, and primed, and you'll be able to start um, your, your airbrush work, and uh, so... This guitar is, this class is really designed for um, the elite guitar, home guitar builder. But what if you've never used an airbrush before? That might turn some people off. How do, can they just jump right in? Well, with the equipment we're going to provide, I mean, it's going to instantly give you an edge over going out and trying to learn the hobby or get introduced oh. to it with crappy equipment. So what equipment are they going to get? They're going to get the Rich Pen 113C Apollo, which is a .3 or a .2 uh, convertible brush. Uh, it's made in Japan by Fuso Seiki. It's That's your airbrush, right? Well, it's one of the brushes that we're cool. selling. Yeah. Yep. Very cool. Yep. So it's got the Mike Learn seal of approval? Yes, it does. And awesome. I, I hand tune them all. Every single one of them goes through and gets polished out as a, as a high-performing piece of equipment. I have actually been talking to your marketing department, and there are some, uh, like, a, a limited-edition Mike Learn airbrush kits that come with this class. That's correct. It's a, it's, a, it's a freaking amazing deal. For the class, you get all this cool stuff, high-end, tier one components, a real-live Floyd, you know, uh, real-live hip shot tuners, um, and you get a Mike Learn airbrush all as part of the class, in addition to this awesome guitar and the uh, all of the knowledge that goes with it to turn a block of wood into this in five days. So, um, yep. so if they show up and they've never used an airbrush before, you're going to be here to walk them through it. Yeah, well, I'll be here uh, getting abused by everybody that week because especially. I think my birthday is like in the middle of the class <laughs> day, so. but uh, uh, yeah, we're going to start off with like a series of stencils that everybody will have the opportunity to uh, pick and choose and create their own little uh, airplane. That's cool. So they can like do any any color and stencil combo they want. Yes. How awesome. Yes, anything they want. They can pick and choose. We'll have some German theme. I'll put together a Japanese theme, and I'll put together cool. a couple American themes. So. You know what? I wouldn't be. We have people who watch all over the world. It wouldn't surprise me one bit if we got somebody from overseas come over for this class. I, this is a cool, cool thing. It is. I think people will be uh, overwhelmed with the, the amount of knowledge they're going to go home with to a certain extent, but it's going to really give them the opportunity to have a lot of fun later on. Totally. What, what, we're, what we're basically going to be building is an heirloom instrument that will stay in you you'll like when your friends come over you will run and grab check out what i did when i was over there and i got to hang out with with mike learn and and we did all this stuff and and mike learn's been on the cover of easy rider and playboy and all kinds of well you haven't been on the cover of playboy but uh, your machines have been <laughs> and um uh and and you'll be able to hang out with mike and and do all this stuff it's 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 such a great opportunity and i i for one am really really excited about the prospect of this class so don't miss the opportunity link in the description below for the class sign up now because uh, space is limited to six. six only six people so um uh well so mike what uh what do you, what else what else should we talk about about the spaz master that should about round us out yeah it? no yeah i think so i think there's you know it's it's a pretty well designed on the fly it was very spontaneous the whole thing so much but, fun doing but it. just like the best songs they come out with very little premeditation they just they kind they of just work themselves out yeah, yeah you're right you're right so all right guys if you have any questions about um the the spaz master build or if you have any questions about the class, please leave them in the description below. I will try to answer them. If you've got anything specific for Mike Learn, um, I will forward them to Mike. He will take care of you. I'll take care of you. Mrs. Toast will take care of you, blah, blah, blah. I don't know what else to say except for this is Matt at Texas Toast reminding you that life is short. You might as well have a super cool guitar that you made. Thanks for watching, you guys. We'll see you next time.